Hello everyone, welcome to add join digital fluency video series. This is a digital fluency part 8 and topic we are going to learn in this video is IOT. Okay, let's see the definition. IOT is a short form of Internet of Things. What is Internet of Things? The standard definition is the Internet of Things referred to a system of interrelated, interconnected objects that are able to collect and transfer a data over a wireless network without human in human intervention see what it is says there is some system it has to be interrelated interconnected means objects are interrelated interconnected but they are not at the same place if there are a object a and a object b okay object a is one place object b is another place they both are related together, linked together, but there is a no wire connection. Means they are connected to each other wirelessly. I can operate object A through object B. Or I can operate object B through object A. Means got it? See, okay. You use this your phone to on and off the light, isn't it? You watch it the TV. There is many advertisement or in movies. Like for example, I say Alexa to play it plays. Means they are not related, not connected. What I am saying is not connected. Okay, I, I tell inside my phone I will on off the buttons. Uh, AC will on and off. Fan will on and off. Means fan is somewhere else and my phone is somewhere else. Means I am operating fan using through my phone. Yes. This is nothing but the internet of things. Two objects are linked together, interconnected together to, and they do the operations through internet. We are making one object operate using another object through internet is nothing but IoT. And in the IoT we have... Uh, what it is called as then we have a iot architecture in these types we have many types but in this whatever we are covering now types are not important before going to example let's see about a iot architecture this is very important if they ask like working or it's an architecture it's a system structure you have to explain it what is iot inside the iot architecture we mainly have layers iot architecture has a three layers First one is IoT device layer, second one is IoT gateway layer, third one is IoT platform layer. See device layer is client side, means we are going to operate now, inside the phone I press the on off, that part, that is client side. And IoT gateway layer is on server side. On server side means fan is turning on and off, that part, server side. Path third one is IoT platform place that is happening. IoT platform layer is nothing but a pathway for connecting the clients and operators. I have a phone. I have a phone. In between this on off happening na internet we are using through internet I am doing. Internet is nothing but a IoT platform layer. Okay. Then we have stages during this IoT architecture. We have mainly four stages. First one is sensors and actuators. Second one is internet gateway and data acquisition system. Third one is edge IT. Fourth one is data center and cloud. Don't go more inside the technical part or deep inside. Let's see about the basically what does they mean. They are like a sensors and actual take care all the materials we need. Okay. And sensor is like a small computer only. Uh, like they are inside the bulb, you watched it now. There is a small thing inside the bulb. Uh, like that, that small only sensors are there. But they are very effective. Why, like uh, we have many like gas sensors. What they do? They detect the gas. What type of gas it is? We have a temperature sensors. What it do? It reads the temperature. Those are the building blocks. If we install the sensors and they tell what it is and we all the coding part when we do is according to this gas we have to do the this situation. 
sensor identify the gas if it is uh, our uh, daily cooking uh, cylinder gas then it identifies this is a hot form gas then the action what we write in the code you have to off the gas yes sensors of the building blocks then comes the internet gateways means between the these all we have instruments now we are connecting them not physically but logically through internet that internet acts as a gateways and the all the data that we need okay information about the gases uh, for example and uh, if uh, action the action we have to do all the information we have to get in the edge it means edge it means end technologies then data center and a cloud many times so once action is happened na that action happened and reaction happened get stored if the same repeats if earlier action is pro proper and correct the repeat action will performs if the earlier one is wrong then new reaction will give up like this let's see about the examples example like if we have a smart home appliances like alexa and connected appliances like alexa only and autonomous and many times uh, like there is a smart home systems like whenever night happens light automatically gets on and whenever car comes gate automatically opens whenever person comes door automatically opens those type of system and a wireless devices like wireless bluetooth we have a uh, wireless uh, phones like my earlier times it is wireless phones we have a smartphone so like biometric see in a school and colleges there is a attendance system biometric uh, thumb press signature face and all those things and then variables see variables is very helpful in uh, current covid times see in hospitals variables are make variable gloves variable uh, glasses face mask and a lot of technical devices like iot enabled devices we are working we are using actually they are examples only best example is alexa okay and the smart home appliances yes uh, smart tv yes i can operate it through phone only and uh, smart fans acs smartphones also examples and the application where all the places we use it we use it in many places and uh, manufacturing industries and uh, payment systems banking system automation systems like automatic vehicles automatic cars and uh, and uh, school management educations hospitals and marine systems many many places because wherever internet is uh, being used and automation is happening means obviously get think it as uh, iot if you see any device working it uh, automatically by itself uh, there is a internet based on the internet internet connection we have provided it is working means it's a iot device yes i hope you got it in next video we are going to see about i iot thanks for watching like share subscribe and comment